my name, my name's Chris, and welcome back to another exciting episode of Let's Play The Legend. Oh my god, what is that? It's a freaking laser shooting asshole! <laughs> uh, okay, um... Boomerang, go! Boomer ow, 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 asshole, 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 dang it! No, give me my rupees back, asshole! <laughs> Jeez, mate. Is there a rat hole that I could throw bait to stop them from eating me? That sucks. Oh, I'm down to a half heart. You know what? Grandmother's soup. I need you to save me from this lifestyle. <laughs> if you guys actually remember, uh, Grandma's soup gives us two servings, which is fantastic. We also have double. Do we not? Oh, I was gonna say, yeah, my sword glows. See, it's all bluey and stuffy. So, oh boy. Oh, do well, there goes my double attack power. That sucked, man. All right, so let's see. This goes clockwise, I think. I always get mixed up between clockwise and counterclockwise. I always have to really think about it. There's no rat hole for me at those speed. That's kind of unfortunate. Wish there was. Uh, so, yeah, I guess you just kind of want to go the way it also goes. That way you get the most amount of time possible for it starts shooting this laser at you. So, uh, oh, no, I see that rat coming. The rat's ass. Look at that asshole. Huh. Is there no rat hole? Maybe if after I kill these guys, they're just done. I, mean, I almost thought maybe he'd drop my five rupees after I kill them. So where the heck is our third statue? <gasps> we are the third statue. And for some reason, these switches don't need to have someone constantly sitting on it. But okay, whatever. A um, bit of a weird bridge or staircase in this. <laughs> I don't know why they just use like another rainbow staircase after you like you know hit all these switches. But whatever. Whatevs. Oh, I'm really disappointed. And then there's that. That platform over there. Hmm. I don't know what that's about. Actually, I kind of do. I know in the original game it had something interesting. And I think in this game it, it did do. Oh, by the way, I should actually explain. Um, in between. Uh, not. Between. Uh, the last episode and the episode before that. <laughs> okay, there, Link. I, um. I looked up all the differences between this game and the original game because I felt like I've, se I've seen enough of this game at this point and I kind of already knew a lot of what was going on. So I figured I might as well look up just to see all the differences just so I'm not kind of mixing stuff up and giving some misinformation here. And well, this room is just a big circle, isn't it? Apparently it is. So uh, I do know a lot of the secrets in this game and I will be 100%ing pretty much everything. Oh, see, it looks like that room is the one we came from. That one's all glowy glow, and the other two are locked. So, head this way then. Whee! I'm gonna try my best to either finish this dungeon or get right. Yeah, actually, I'm definitely not gonna be able to finish in this episode, but I'm gonna at least get to the final boss. <coughs> and I, at most, I'm gonna get to the final boss. Oh god, those switches are so creepy looking, man. Oh no! <laughs> Good boy! Uh, just, just ignore them. There's no point. You don't get anything from them. They'll, they're just annoying to deal with. Okay, another rainbow bridge. It's called a bridge. It's called a rainbow bridge. Seeker of the goddess's guidepost. Press ZR to call me and guide me to my place of truth. ZR? <laughs> uh, this is a bit of a weirder puzzle. <laughs> so you press ZR. Oh, is that going to work anymore? Yeah, you press ZR to call them. They follow you and it's adorable and you can pick them up. So yeah, let's go. <laughs> so now watch Link when I call him. <laughs> Just looks like, hi, come on. <laughs> it's great, I love it. So yeah, you gotta do this very tediously. You gotta make sure you don't guide him off the edge as well. As long as you don't go around a corner. Like if I did this, no, you would walk off the edge and be silly. Although it might be funny to watch. <laughs> I get over here and be like, I'm gonna jump across, he'll jump too, right? No, we have to, ooh. I remember if we have to throw him. Well, they don't gotta throw him. <laughs> it didn't look like I could make that jump. I feel like you should not be able to make that jump. Ow. Uh, all these symbols on here. I wonder if that says anything in Hylian as well. Probably does, to be honest. Oh, look, I don't have to. Oh, I could've checked it. I uh, probably meant just check that, though. All right, fast forward away. All right, okay, so I guess we've got to jump across with him. Did I might get there and wonder what the heck you're supposed to do, but yeah, there we go. Oh boy. Oh boy. Yeah. Ha -ha. 
I tricked you, assholes. Uh, I still can't do anything with that. I mean, if you guys have watched slash played other Zelda games, you probably know what those little eyeballs on the wall mean and what it means for this dungeon, what item we're gonna get. But if you don't know, then shh. Just, just, just relax. It'll all be okay. Just, it'll all be ogre soon, as Shrek might say. This temple's weird, man. <laughs> You lead these weird looking statues and they hop along and then, and then they go on here and that makes a pedestal price up and then there's these weird statues as well. Oh, they all look different. That one has raised horns. That one has like arm, like flexing arms <laughs> kind of horns. And those just don't, do they don't have horns? Or do they just have horns? To, oh, they just have horns going in the back. That's cool. They have like ram horns. They actually are pretty cool. And here, I think. If I'm correct here, wait, oh, you know what, actually, while I'm here, I might as well show. We're, this is a quest status screen, I have not showed this yet. Um, yeah, here's all the quest items that are important and stuff. Pirate's Charm, I know that's what that stone's called. The sail, the Wind Waker, all the pearls we got, a current count of treasure charts and our pieces of heart. Have we gotten an entire, I don't think we've gotten a heart container from, from pieces of heart yet, have we? Huh. Alright, so yeah, that's our quest status screen. In case you're wondering. Uh, where is our Wind Waker? Oh, right, 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 right. Wind Waker's always on here. Oops, I can't see that, actually. So. Looks like it's our... F oh. oh. Okay. <laughs> it's our first 4-4 four four song. So, I'll change it to that. Go damn in the middle. And to the right. And damn. I don't know why I'm damning it for, but I am damning it. I'm beaver damn it. <laughs> I apologize. You learned the command melody. The most annoying command melody. Or most annoying song in the game. Maybe. My kin wait beyond the doors. Control them and guide them to their places of truth. To open the path to the gods. That's weird. <laughs> it's weird that bringing just one of them activates us. It's like you're going to have to bring them all to learn this. Yay. Yep. Alright. So let's head through this one, the one the door just opened. Oh, I know it's coming up. Oh boy. Oh boy! Oh yeah, I can't forget. Ah! I forgot the boomerang doesn't affect these. That's so weird. It's like you would think it would. It's like, why would it not, right? Aha! <laughs> I don't think. Oh, you know what? I know what I can do here. Maybe. Oh yeah, that worked. Okay, great. Okay, great. I don't know why. We haven't really been well. I was gonna say we haven't been using our deck to leave. I say as I just finish using it. Uh, there's another room over there, but that's blocked off. There's that, but we'll get back to that later. Oh boy! All right, there's our second section. No, no. <laughs> Oops. Oh, it's weird how they can make like little grappling hook points so like elegant looking. All right, as the mighty Link might say, come on! <laughs> he waves the hook at him. <laughs> That's perfect. All righty, now, how the Bilbo Baggins are we gonna get this guy across here? Well, he, can you he take this grappling hook guy? Can you grapple across here? Just take a second and picture that. This guy grappling across. <laughs> Pretty great, isn't it? All right, so this is a bit of an interesting puzzle, but since I know the solution, I'm not gonna waste any time here. We might do this, then we're gonna even want to use the song. We, oops, we're gonna use the song we just learned here. So left nothing, right nothing. Yeah, I haven't described my special song remembering thing this game yet. Oh yeah, I really like how he turns green as well. But yeah, the command melody makes you take command of some things, and it's seriously only used a few times in the game. Well, on a few different things, I should say. <clears throat> in this temple, and then two other temples. <clears throat> Get used to using the song, though, because you will be using it a lot. A lot, a lot. <sighs> Although, I don't think we use it that much in this temple, but I'm pretty sure it following temples. Oh, good lord. Um, let's see what this does. Ooh. Ah, oh, dang it, it closed. <laughs> of course it did. All right, so, but if we leave this room, won't it be bad? Because won't he disappear? I mean, I guess we kind of have to. Do oh, 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 no, no, no. Oh, okay, good. Phew. 
I was waiting for this to come out. I was like, this is not going to work. Link, it is I, the King of Reliance. Okay, you're the one that's been talking to me to this, through this forever, so I don't know why you would say that. I'm afraid there are some areas to which you will not be able to bring the servants of the tower. But do not fear leaving them behind. Once you have awakened them, they will wait patiently for your return. This, of this I assure you. How do you know that? How what? How can he possibly know that? Oh yeah, one thing I do feel I should mention is I'm not going crazy and turning, being able to turn left or right on this grappling hook thing was not a feature in the original game. You could if you would stop swinging on the rope and then uh, rotate, but you wouldn't. You were never able to swing and turn at the same time. I don't know why. That's a bit strange to be honest, but I'm really happy they changed that. My favorite enemies of the game. I love this. Oh, so cool. It's freaking dark nuts. Oh, Link's determination on his face. So you might be wondering, what the heck? How do I do this? Oh no, I pressed the wrong button. <laughs> ah. Oh crap, there goes your helmet. And there goes your armor. All right, let's take care of the armor. These guys are actually, why, why could I have pressed A there? Ah. Oh, almost missed that. Bam. Wait, wait, I want to see some here. Oh no, he's just gonna pick up the sword. Can I, can I make you drop your sword without killing? No. Oh, <laughs> his arms went all squiggly when I did that. That was perfect. Yay! Oh, I thought he was gonna let me leave the room. <laughs> kind of weird. They would give this chest, or they would cause this to like not open. Let me. Whatever. Okay. Uh, swing it. I can swing my swords. I'm sorry. So yeah, with this giant thing. Could smash pillars and it's fantastic. Oh god, it looks so cool. I want a close-up shot of that. Oh, so cool. I love it. Yeah, so we destroy this entire room and then BAM! And these guys actually known for dropping their knight's crests. So yay, knight's crest. Open the freaking treasure chest. Oh my good lord! You got the hero's bow! Uh, use it with the oh, use it with the button you set to right. Hold the button to knock an arrow and release the button to shoot. Okay, thirty arrows. Yay! Can I just take this sword instead? I love it. <laughs> it's so huge. How could I even lift that? That thing must weigh so much. It must weigh weigh like freaking three times as much as Link does. So yay! It's the bow and arrow time. And this is actually where I'm kind of sad. I'm not using the um the game pad. Yeah, of course, those will drop arrows in case you really suck. <laughs> and yeah, these these cause the bubbles to respond. Bam! So yeah, you gotta be careful with how you aim these. It actually is kind of hard to aim it. Oh, I could strafe. I forgot about that. Bam! So yeah, much like any Zelda game ever, you could use that. Or you could use. Or the eye switches pretty much mean hit it with an arrow. To make the eye go. What? Oh, I was gonna say, where'd the dude go? But here's the dude. He's just waiting over here. All like, he even looked at me like, hey, what's up? What's up, Link? <laughs> Alrighty. Uh. <coughs> uh, okay, let's see what we got here. Eh, pretty much finishing up in this these rooms here. Oh, you know, I just realized the boss is on the top. Are we gonna be fighting the boss on the very top of the top? What the heck? Uh, okay, we're just gonna walk away. <laughs> Did that statue just come to life? Well, I mean, I guess that shouldn't be too surprising. I'm, I'm dealing with live statues already, so, you know. <laughs> Yay, I did it. Look at this face. He's like, Arrgh! That caused that door to open. Yay! Do, 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 do. We're starting to get down low on hearts again. Dude, I guess the rooms I complete, their doors don't glow. That's a good way to show. This room is in a giant circle, so... Oh, you know what I should probably do? <sighs> now that we got the bow and arrow, we can actually go get a treasure chest in the first part of the temple. How should we tackle this? Mm, let's start on this side again. Whoa, Keith! Calm down there, Keith! Oh, this room, right? This room is also... I'm pretty sure this isn't in the game. So I'm just gonna go ahead and oh good lord, why would I do that, dude? <sighs> in the original game, in this room, there was a tingle tuner thing where um, 
tingle would come out. Actually, I should probably explain the tingle tuner one more time because I haven't really talked about it in a while. Tingle tuner instead of the tingle bottles. Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah. Oh, good lord. The tingle tuner would be you get instead of a tingle bottle that makes things happen. Dang it. Is that going to go in sync or something? Um, you'd be able to essentially connect your Game Boy Advance to the GameCube. And oh, there's a pot over there. I want to know what's in those pots. Ah. And uh, Tingle will talk to you as you play the game, and you kind of like commentate and like be a little sidekick, and it's awesome. He's like he's like Navi, but like a Navi you're actually happy to talk. To. Can, I, can I not make that shot? Is there somewhere else I could jump to? I mean, I, look, I could definitely make that shot, but maybe you should jump on this here to make it a bit easier for myself. But, uh, yeah, Tingle would essentially become your Navi of this game. You got it, Smokies! It opened the... Yeah, we, we know it's Smokies, too. There's no need, Chris. There's no need at all. Oh man. Come on. But, uh, in this room, um, Tingle would ask you to walk around the room and find five pages of the gods or something like that. And I remember only being able to find, like, three or four, which is weird because this room has very limited walking space. So what? 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 Maybe we gotta kill everything. <gasps> Damn! Oh, ooh, that could have ended very badly. I mean, it still ended kind of. Wait, wasn't I already down now, heart and a half? Anyways, <laughs> I remember never being able to find all the tingle pages for whatever reason. I I don't know why, but it was a thing. <laughs> and um, yeah, that's what this room just very vividly reminds me of. I feel like if it wasn't for that, this room would be very forgettable. Ooh, can we snipe this guy out, please? Oh, you know what? We gotta hit that eye switch. Oh. Whoa, okay. That was a bit scary. Oh, Link's not looking so well with his heart and half. I don't know what's in this. Might be like a. I don't think it's like a key or anything. Is it a. Oh, maybe this is just rupees. Could very well be. Oh, I kinda wanna know what's in those pots down there. Probably be hearts if this was like not healable. You got a joy pen! Yeah, joy pendants are seriously like the troll of this game. They suck. <laughs> All right, you know what? Screw those pots. All right, we've cleared this room. Let's let's just. Oh man, no. Uh, actually, no. Ah! There we go. There we go. Okay. This is, this is Deku Leaf over here. I don't care about those pots anymore. <laughs> oh, you know what we should have done? We should have actually. Well, let's say we should have went to that room first, because we actually have to. The only way to get to that room. Oh, good lord's keys! Don't you dare! Don't you dare take chip damage. I think that would be called. Oh no. Oh no. No, no, no. Ah, you dink! Screw you, assholes! Alright, so this works like a scale. <laughs> you can already see, but you know, I was kind of occupied with the battle there. Yeah. Trying to be very careful here. If only a heart, I think a bomb would have killed me. Although maybe, well, yeah, it probably would have killed me, actually. <laughs> Enemies do do quarter hearts of damage. <laughs> Those guys don't look super intimidating at all, at all or anything. They look really creepy, actually. Man, that's that's scary. So, these rooms here. You, you'll see this occasionally in the game. Designs that reflect wind are drawn here. So that's your hint. Wind, eh? You might be wondering, what the heck? Well, it doesn't make the, like, fanfare noise of the doodly doo Kind of telling you, hey, there's something here, you silly. So, yeah, you want to use the wind. What was that? I heard a whoo. Yeah, it makes these. It's weird. That's really, like, obscure, and I don't understand. Oh, good lord! Uh, 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 throw a bomb! <laughs> oh, no, 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 no! Whoa, okay. Can we, can we get oh, no! God dang it! Oh, we didn't even get the treasure chest, so we have to go back there. Oh man, why did I not take Grandma's juice? I keep forgetting I even have that. Grandma's juice, you failed me. No. <laughs> All right, I guess we'll end it off there. Well, no, we gotta go get that treasure chest first. Um. Uh, ooh, actually, hmm. since we're here, we might as well go back and get the treasure I missed in the first part here. I need water to go up. Rising up, 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 rising up, up. Come on, water. Yeah, we go. All right. Oh no. Okay, so we actually missed treasure in this first room. That's because we didn't have the bow and arrow yet. Da -da 
don't know. This would have been better if we didn't come get get this till now. Uh, uh, uh the boomerang or the sorry, the the bow and arrow just kind of replaces the boomerang in my opinion. The boomerang stuns most enemies. Bow and arrow just it doesn't stun most enemies; it kills most enemies. So it, it's like the boomerang times a million. Except I guess the boomerang is not a consumable. So bow and arrow, it's kind of like the default if you want arrows, I suppose. <gasps> You got a treasure chart. Open the chart on the map screen and place where treasure will be lit up and stuff. Yay. Oh, boy. Uh, you know what? We haven't dealt with these guys yet, so let's do that. So, deal with these guys. Okay. I don't... That was weird. Uh, you gotta hit the gem on the back there. Oh, dang it, dude. Ah. I thought that... Oh, I guess they just had to run into you. Yeah, so we gotta break the weird gem on their back. and it, It's weird. They're not too special. Uh, I will meet you guys back in that um, room where we were, where we got the treasure chest, and then I died to those big dudes I don't remember the name of. Oh no, I don't want my ship. Alright, so see you guys in a second. Okay, I'm back, and this time I'm deadly serious this time. Bam! And. Oh no. Ah, the freaking targeting thing doesn't work too well. So yeah, they open their mouth, they throw a bomb in it, they close their mouth, and they're like, uh oh. Why did I open my mouth for? I'm not very smart. No, am I? Ha 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 ha. And they drop nothing special. Yay! Break all the things. Yay! Well, it's got the ruby. Let's see what's inside here and off the episode. The spiky chest. Is it gonna be another bone arrow? I'm gonna deal wheel, dual wheel bone arrows. <gasps> You got a treasure chart, and it's really weird that they're giving you a treasure chart in this treasure chest. Why did they not just give it to me in the cool chest? Like, if, whatever. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like and subscribe if you already. My name's Chris. Oh, does this guy have all three horns? He does. What? That's really cool. Wow. In the next episode, we will more than likely finish up the Tower of the Gods, and I did not do as nearly as much progress as I wanted to in this episode, but that's okay. Because I'll definitely finish the next time. Ooh, we gotta go back for that treasure chest as well. Um, so, yep, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye bye!